see from the title of this video, I am reviewing my first human hair wig ever. But not only that, but I'm comparing it to a synthetic wig. So, wow. There's a lot going on today. If you guys are already subscribed, then you know that I do a lot of wig review videos. No wigs that I have tried on are human hair wigs. How, how am I gonna feel with someone else's hair on my head? That, I don't even know. I feel like that's a personal thing. The human hair wig is from Dye Hair 77? 7? 7, 7, 7. DY hair, dye hair, dye hair. I wanna say dye, I don't really know. They were super nice and they sent me this whole like little bag thing and I am wow excited, wow. I don't know what to think. I'm nervous for this human hair wig. I'm gonna do the human hair wig second because I'm a little scared to be honest. But we have the synthetic wig that is from Uniwigs. If you guys have seen my other wig haul videos, you know I review Uniwigs all the time. They're pretty solid wigs, guys. For both of the wigs, all the links are going to be down below. So make sure to check those out. I have coupon codes. Feel free to click around down below as you're listening to my beautiful commentary. We got the Uniwigs wig. Let's see what she looks like. I believe this is a red doll wig. I was right. <laughs> this is like Little Mermaid. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I should be wearing. I should be wearing a purple shirt. Oh. Oh my god, the brush too. Oh my god, I love their brushes. The brushes. We have this synthetic. Red long wig from Uniwigs. Look at this, guys. I am. I am Ariel. I didn't even put the wig on yet, but I can tell. Guys, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I wish you guys could feel this right now. Please get this wig and then feel it, and we can talk about it. Oh my god, it's so smooth. Okay, let me. I'm sorry. I'm so weird. Guys, if anyone's watching this video and they don't know anything about wigs, like. You won't understand. I don't want to exclude you if you've never held a wig before, but they feel pretty good, okay? Look at this! Oh my god! Oh my god! I could throw up. This is so beautiful. Oh, it's not even a bad length. Wow, some wigs are like way too long, but this is like good. This is a synthetic lace front wig. Lace front means that the hair is actually like weaved through this in the front. Instead of it being a solid like line of where the wig like starts. It's kind of gradual, so it looks pretty real when you're wearing a solid wig cap. Or if you um, have matching hair color and then you can like pull your hair through it, but like I can't do that. So I'm going to put on a wig cap and I'm going to cut this lace to match my hairline and then we're going to put it on and review it, shall we? Yeah, boys! Okay, let's see what she Oh, oh my god. Look at this wig though. What's the scene from The Little Mermaid? What can we do? I must have something purple. Oh my god. Wait, 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 wait. This t-shirt is the only purple thing I own. Let's channel our inner Little Mermaid, shall we? Oh, look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? But daddy, I love him. I know that movie way too well. So we're all in agreement that I am the new Little Mermaid, right? Take a screenshot, tweet this picture to Disney and be like, we have your Little Mermaid. We found her. It's me. Thank you. Thanks. So, with lace front wigs, you can always make them look a little bit more realistic by plucking out the part. But I'm not going to mess with this wig too much. We're doing a basic review. So right now, all I can tell you is that because of the length and the thickness, it does get a little tangled. So if you were trying to wear this all day, every day, keep a brush in your bag. And not just any brush, you have to use one of their brushes that, oh, this looks gross right now. You have to use a special brush that will not like tangle it and pull out the strands of hair because that happens a lot, you know? The color and everything looks great. It is literally exactly like the picture, which is always great. Uniwigs is very good about that. So this just in, I am quitting YouTube and I'm gonna work for Disney now. Goodbye, Ariel, going back under the sea. Let's go. Okay, so now we have the human hair wig that I'm gonna take out of the bag for the first time. Okay, here we go. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, this is someone's hair? It's so long. It feels really nice. Oh my God, it is so soft. I feel like I have to be really fragile. Oh my God. Oh my god, this is real human hair. This is 
real. I am touching someone's hair right now. Whose hair is this? Where are they from? Where do they live? What do they do now? So it is a lace front wig. It actually has some like little wisps, like some little short hairs in the front that makes it super realistic, wow. Guys, what if this looks too good on me? What if I never want to take it off? Okay, so I guess just like any other wig, I am going to put on my wig cap and I'm going to cut the lace and we're going to try it on. Oh, oh my God, who is she? Oh my God, S um, wow. I don't even know where to start. Okay, so this wig is pretty long. Look at that, not bad at all. It is not super thick, which is great because that would be a lot of human hair on my face. When my natural hair was this long, it was definitely this thick. This is extremely realistic because this hair is real hair that means I can wash it this means I can curl it this means I can straighten it this means I can dye it if I wanted to it's like endless I understand financially it is hard to be able to throw hundreds and hundreds of dollars into wigs but with human hair you can do so much more without severely damaging it enough that it's noticeable unlike a synthetic haired wig where if you run heat over a synthetic hair wig over and over again the quality depletes like there is no tomorrow. Uniwigs actually does a very good job at having their hair feel very nice and conditioned. Their wigs are a little bit thicker, which is nice because you have a lot to play with if you were going to cut them or anything like that. I want you guys to understand that wigs should not be something you should hide behind. They are basically in addition, they're something fun, they're an accessory. Whether you know wearing wigs is by choice or you feel like you have to, you should really understand that beauty is on the inside 100%. So once you are comfortable with yourself, it does not matter what you look like on the outside at all. I wanna see what you guys do with your wigs if you wear them. You can DM me on Instagram, you can tweet me, just send me pictures of you wearing wigs, I love it. I wanna see what you guys do, I wanna see what you guys look like. So DM me, send me pictures, I wanna see it. You guys are so amazing, thank you so much for watching this video and you know, happy, uh, wig wearing. <laughs> Bye.